welcome back to my channel i feel like it's been forever since i've sat in front of this freaking camera oh i feel like like for real i missed you guys i hope you guys are doing well things have just been so crazy around here graduation is literally 30 days from today today is april 26th I can't believe that and then a prom is in like not this coming weekend but the following weekend the weekend of single that mile is prom weekend and so yeah it's been crazy i've been trying to like deep clean everything go through it get rid of it um yeah i just did my room i did the movie room now i gotta move to the kitchen and the also side note it is storming so if you guys hear thunder that's what it is um so yeah, I've been just trying to, you know, get stuff done. I hope you guys are well. We are doing well. Sophie has been working like a crazy person. Her big boss is currently at a different store. He's being like area coach. Excuse me. So it has her working crazy long hours. She's working like 10 hour days, which she's not used to. So she comes home and she is ready to be done with the day. I feel like we don't even see her. Um, So yeah, it's been very... Like, our days are just flying. But I wanted to come on here and do a little video with you guys. Also, another side note. If um, you guys are interested in any of my keychains or any backpack charms, um, bracelets, what else? Mini bookmarks, all that jazz. I will be doing a live sale tomorrow. This video is going to go up today. Sorry for the late notice, guys. It's kind of just like a surprise live sale. If you can make it, you can make it. And if you can't, that's okay. I probably won't do another one for a while. We'll see. But I wanted to give my YouTube people some chance to snack some of those goodies. So, yeah. Um. Also, today's cup, y'all. We're doing hypnotic over here. Um, This is like a random video. I know you guys have been wanting to see my uh, shelves. So, that's what we're going to do in today's video. But before we get started, I have a piece of done that we did pick up that I wanted to share with you guys. And it's kind of ironic that I'm wearing this shirt because it goes with that. If you follow me on IG, you probably already know what it is. I feel like I'm talking so fast today, so slow down, okay? <laughs> slow down, girl. Okay, can you guys guess? Guess, but if you follow me on Instagram, don't guess because then you know ready it is the encanto canister with the candle on it you guys i love this so much it's got bruno luisa maribel isabella and abuela and julieta i'm like what the heck is her name uh the family of magic it's so pretty this piece was expensive we went into tj and i saw it and so he was like grab it you wanted that line um and I was like, no. I was like, it's $30. I think I took the price tag off. $30, $29.99. Here comes me. $29.99 at the TJ Maxx. Uh, but she was like, you have to have it. So if the light looks crazy, guys, I'm using that crazy light that makes it look crazy. But I had to share it with you guys. I'm like, it's so perfect. Hi. You all right? She's like, Dia's got something on her. Hello. You want to say hi? Oh wait, Thea's gonna change position, so go lay on the bed. All right guys, I'm gonna show you my shelves now. So let's get into it. Okay y'all, I will start off with the actual thing. Um, so I have a mirror on top of this um, little square unit. It's literally just square. There we go, hopefully the lighting is a little better. The Giselle, and I have a candle, and then this pretty little rose that my grandmother gave me. With the A, of course. And then I have my pretty um, Sleeping Beauty handheld mirror that Esther gifted me one Christmas. I have the Tinkerbell, um, jewelry box. And then over here, I have this little jewelry thing that I made of, like, a million years ago. Um, I just keep all my pretty jewelry, um, earrings. What are these, like, costume earrings? Are some of my absolute favorites to collect, if you can tell. <laughs> And then I have this new, this is the newer um, Mary Poppins 
And then Marie puzzle that my sister did. Um, it was a birthday gift. You guys probably seen that in a birthday video if you watched that. My little Thunderbolt ornament because he did not finish fit on my Corella shelf. A Pearl A. I don't know if that's where he's going to stay, but. And then I have this little pot, like a little clay piece thing that um, I made. And then a necklace that my cousin made with my Andrea spelled the other way. And excuse if this thing is like a million years old for y'all. So if you see coloring, we've moved like a million times. So that could be what. Okay. Now first little square of this is Maleficent. Um, There's just tons of her. I literally just dusted these. Literally like two days ago. Um, So yeah, there's Maleficent. If you guys have any questions about anything, just let me know. Um, Pop is a makeup palette, wet brush, you can barely see it, pumpkin, a stuffy from Five Below, I don't even know, I don't even know. This came from a card game, this is a, a Funko lip balm, a Tsum Tsum lip balm, another Tsum Tsum when Tsum Tsums were in the lip balm that goes with that, obviously very done. Um, Funkos everywhere, this is from a cupcake from like a million years ago, a little like Pez that came with the makeup. And then a perfume. And then a like mystery keychain. I believe this was a mystery as well. And then this is from like a toy set that my little sisters had when they were little. Alright y'all I have Maleficent trying to get like glow. Because I forget that the dragon glows. So I want to see if we'll be able to see it on camera. So I'm trying to get it to like charge up for y'all. Alright y'all I'm going to try to be quick. I'm going to try to turn this off and move those things. Ready? Oh, dang. Look, you guys. She's so cool. I love her so much. And then you come over here and you see Aurora. I don't have as much Aurora. I wish, but I don't. Um, A little, like, one of these adorable blind bag. That was a little princess blind bag. A Tsum Tsum. And then the little, the really pretty Sleeping Beauty um book journal from the shop Disney. Esther bought me that a few years ago. And then all the Sleeping Beauty makeup, which you guys have seen when I've showed you in hauls. Obviously, the Sleeping Beauty topper mug, one of my absolute favorites. And then there's a crystal puzzle like the Marie that was on top. That was Esther's, but I jacked it. And then my Funko that my aunt bought me. This little woodsy candle-like thing that I thought went with her vibe that I made like a million years ago. Um, My Aurora ornament. And then that's more of those little pieces. And then I was gifted this in a um, few years ago. I did a Disney Christmas gift swap. And the person bought me the anniversary water bottle. Oh, I love it so much. And then Malia gifted me that book for my birthday. I believe it was my birthday or Christmas. One of the two. And then the little woodsy animals back there. So that's Sleeping Beauty. And then you come over here. If I would have Funkos for the Dalmatians, I would literally do it like this, where it was Cruella and Dalmatians, but I don't, so it's just a mixture. Um, Cruella has no space, guys. Like, I have literally no room to put anything anymore on this shelf, but, you know, YOLO. Um, Zoom Zoom plushie when those were came out, another Zoom Zoom blind bag, Cruella brush, um, Funko palette, the pumpkins from, what? a year or two ago this is the color pop of cruella makeup kit that my aunt bought me the perdita pongo anita and roger ornament of disney pin my cruella ornament that's the cruella like um dang it what is it perfume um cruella nails i actually do have maleficent nails but they're like way back there um the cruella lip balm the live action Cruella Funko that I got for Christmas. This is the diamond one. I don't even know where from. The car one. I have some postcards that I've bought in off of people. Um, off of Disney sellers on Instagram. I have the Cruella ring. Just like the Maleficent. A Cruella face mask. This is like a little Funko figurine. I don't know who it's by. It might be by Funko. Um, that somebody gifted it to my aunt. And she knew I love Cruella. So she gifted it to me. And then the Pez. Which came with the Funko makeup and then Dalmatian and Cruella Tsum Tsum that was a blind bag so there's Cruella like you guys have to see the nails let me see like look at these these are from um spirit like two years ago oh, I love them so much 
Also, can we talk about how I didn't like drop anything but this little pin? And because I dropped the pin, I had to pick up my ornament to move it and uh, remember that the My Perdita and Pongo keychains that I bought myself a long time ago are there too. Well, guys, I had to show you the Maleficent nails since I showed you the Cruella. Oh, so, so cute. Okay, so from Cruella, you go here and it is goofy. I mean, if you guys know, I do collect goofy for my dad. <laughs> Um, my grandma found this, I believe, and I was like, yep, taking that, thank you. <laughs> and then, I think my mom bought me this goofy pin for Christmas, um, one year. As well as the movie cover that's a clutch, so it's a little, like, purse. Uh, goofy Tsum Tsum, my grandma found this at the Segunda, which is the thrift store. Um, and I was like, yes ma'am, thank you. And then I have some ornaments, the Goofy and Max, and then the Goofy Golfing. And then those little pictures Esther drew for me. Keep telling her, you guys, she needs to sell her art. Like, look at those. They're amazing. And then last birthday, Malia bought me the Goofy Fishing. And then on this shelf, I kept it more like Disneyland or, you know, just Disney in general. So you have these Sleeping Beauty and Walt Disney Funko. This will not come out of the box because it's my absolute favorite and I don't want it to get ruined. But look at Walt with little Mickey. Esther bought me that for a birthday gift. This is Esther's ornament that I jack every year from the tree and put it in here. Because I think it goes perfectly. And then in here is a Disney themed necklace that uh, one of my bosses gave me a few years back when I worked for a flower shop. That was her gift for us for Christmas, me and my aunt. And then this is Esther's Tower of Terror pin, which of course is not Tower of Terror in Disneyland anymore. It is broke, so I was like, sister, I am putting it in my room because it is one of my favorite rides and one of my favorite things. It is a 3D type of pin. It's from 2008. And then I have this old school camera because I like to collect old school cameras. Um, So I have this one and another one. And then I have some old books. There's my postcard from Daniel. And keep it here with my Disneyland stuff. Um, some old school books. I love old Disney books. So when my grandmother finds them, because she works at a thrift store, um, she picks them up. And every time I go to her house, I'm like, Grandma, I found another book in your shelf. And I'm taking it. And she's like, Miha, you're the reason I buy them. So I'm like, period. This one is super cool. Like, look how old it is. I love this so much. Um, this one, I think it's from 1930. Yeah, 1939. And then this one I believe is 74, 75, um, 74. And this is like a make it book. So it's like a DIY book. Like, look how cute. So I have those two. I do have more, but these are the older ones. So these are the ones I keep on the shelf. And then believe is my favorite word. If you did not know, that is my absolute favorite word in the whole world. And Esther had a friend that could draw really good, which Esther can too, but like, I don't know. Well, you know, Esther just, I don't know. Um, and I had her make this into a galaxy themed because galaxy themed was my thing back then. But I feel like it just goes well with the Bolt and Mickey. Okay, y'all, I have no, so under Maleficent, that was under uh, Aurora. I have no idea how this happened. Ariel is not one of my favorites. <laughs> um... Yeah, I don't know how this happened at all. So I've just kept going with it. It reminds me of Malia. And, you know, that's my sister. So she had a thing for Little Mermaid when she was little. I want to say it started with, like, that bag. And then I ended up with those cute little, like, Ariel and Eric's and that mirror. I bought the mirror and the bag at the same time. And it just went from there. My mom bought me those postcards. And I was like, okay, you know, when I put my shelves together, I was like, I have some mermaid stuff. We'll just put it there. And then when Esther bought those Funko palettes, she bought more stuff and was able to get the Pez. And so now I have all of the villain Pezes from Ulta. And then she bought me that for my birthday. I believe that was Esther or my mom. One of them. And then Sophie bought these eye masks. For, she said for Nevaeh and I was like, yeah, um, no. Those are going on my Little Mermaid shelf. And then, like I said, it's just keep going. So I was like, obviously, you might as well just buy the Ray Dunn mug. Um, these little monos or little toys come from, uh, a Disney, a Little Mermaid playset that my sister had. 
this is one of those like disney blind bags i love that those brushes are my favorite so when i saw it i was like um yes as about me triton i think that was the first funko for this shelf and i was like here we go and then that's a funko blind bag these were the little like princess blind boxes adorable zoom zoom this was a keychain uh mystery keychain and then the little max over there as part of the play set and then ursula pumpkin and then ariel was a little car adorable blind bag that i got on my stocking last year so there's the little mermaid <laughs> yeah it's so random because i'm like she's not my favorite but hey here we are and it's cute so who's ready for the movie Malia already wants to buy tickets so we can go the day before graduation okay y'all up next is peter pan i do have more like cute bags of peter pan um peter pan is one of my absolute favorites um if you've ever heard the uh lost boy song by ruth b i think it is i am a lost boy from neverland that song um when i listened to it it was kind of like uh it had a lot of meaning to me so i just fell in love even more with peter pan so then this started, um, like I said, I have a lot of bags, like cosmetic bags for Peter Pan, and a lot of them are super cute. I just don't have space for all of them. So the Believe, I want to say, came from my grandma, and I was like, you know, Peter Pan, you got to believe. And then she, my grandma was having a yard sale, and she was getting rid of TikTok, and I was like, um, no, ma'am, I'm taking him. So I had that, and so when we moved here, I just piled it. Um my grandpa tony thomas's dad bought us this when he came to visit last i think esther bought me those as christmas or birthday gifts i don't remember but it's um peter pan and captain hook on the peter pan ride at disneyland esther bought me the peter pan bag i think esther bought me all my peter pan bags that i have actually esther's love language is gift giving she's a great gift giver um the brush i want to say was my mom and or esther and then i have the tote bag that matches it i also have a cute little makeup bag that has Wendy and Peter like when they're about to kiss super cute um Tsum Tsum of Tinkerbell uh Peter Pan Funko Mystery uh TikTok adorable Peter Pan adorable and then there's the Tsum Tsums with Peter Pan and Captain Hook and then the Never Never Grow Up um Ray Dan mug um yeah I have a TikTok stuff animal somewhere and I need to go look for it this is reminding me but um the zoom zooms were all sophie's when she collects zoom zooms if you guys are like what the heck here's how you spell it um they're from japan zoom zooms but these were all sophie's look let's go to her so far. um and then she was gonna give them away and i ended up keeping them and they all ended up going with like things i started collecting and then the ornament that esther bought this year the peter pan one and it's got his shadow in the back love that so much so yeah there's peter p okay guys this is the newest shelf um this was jasmine and aladdin i have a, an aladdin funko with um jafar as a snake um i just didn't have a lot jasmine's one of my absolute favorites but i don't have a lot of her and so i was like i really want to display my Kronk and yzma and i've had this ornament in my room just haven't had nowhere to put it so i was like let's open my funkos put them on display so we have Ember's New Groove. That Funko my mom bought me for Christmas last year. And then Esther bought me the wallet. I want to say this keychain from Esther as well. So is this an amazing nail polish that's never going to get used because it's just amazing. Ornament is from Esther as well. Shop Disney. And then my mom bought me the kitty. I want to say Esther bought me Cusco. And the pin. And then I bought these um, Yzma keychains from a Disney seller. It's so cute. Can you guys guess the last shelf? Can you guess? Can you guess? Can you guess? Let me know what your guesses are. Okay, y'all. Were you right? Were you right? It's Lady. Obviously. Let me go goof. So I have some Lady and the Tramp mugs. If you guys don't know, I had a miniature Dotson. And her name was Lady. And she was my bestest friend. Um, so I collect Lady for her. And then Tramp, I always say, is Toretto. Because he just loved licking Lady in her face, like kissing her, and she could not stand it. 
so I always call them Lady and the Tramp. But um, I have the Lady and the Tramp Funkos. I want to say those are from Esther. A mystery keychain that I bought, and I, and I ended up with Tramp. I think I have two Tramps. And then a little Lady Flocked Funko keychain. Look how cute. I don't know where that came from. Esther, maybe. Um, Tony Cup that my mom bought me for my birthday. Another ornament that Esther bought me. The Lady and the Tramp McDonald's toys. Love those. We went crazy buying all of them when we... I came out another ornament from Esther. All right, y'all. I just noticed that my little lady, Tsum Tsum, uh, had fallen, but there she is. And then on the side here, I have that um, newspaper that I bought. I don't know if you guys remember. I did do it. But I saw this on a live sale one day, and I was like, um, that's amazing. So I had to have it. So that stays there. And then my mom has bought me two Lady of the Tramp cards for Valentine's Day. This was the I think this was last, was that year before, I don't know, this has been a few years actually. I'm trying to see if I have a year, no. And then this one was last year, I believe. No, this one was last year because I had the little card and then this one was the older one. I think, I don't know, but those stay on the side. So yeah, there's Lady. So there is my shelves, y'all. I love them so much and they just keep getting fuller and fuller <laughs> i need like actual bookshelf i said i want to get an actual bookshelf so i can like blend it like merge those two together merge that into dalmatians you know so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed this little tour let me know which one was your favorite i honestly can't choose um they're just getting more and more filled so yeah but i love them all and i want more shelves like i want a marie so that's why I'm like, I need to get a bigger one of these or actual bookshelf or both. We'll see. So yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. Don't forget, like I said, I'm doing a live sale tomorrow, 8, I think I said 8.30 my time, which is 9.30 Eastern, 7.30 Mountain, and 6.30 Pacific. So hopefully I will see you guys there. If not, that is okay. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to hit that little bell wherever it may be so you know when your girl posts new videos bye guys